Hello, my name is Nicolai Green and in today's video I'll show you how to turn your autumn photos into something very moody and cinematic using Lumina Neo. Whether you have photos of golden leaves or moody landscapes, it's all about the atmosphere when editing photos from autumn. And in today's video I'll show you step by step how to do it. So, I have chosen this photo which is from the Faroe Islands in a very moody condition with fog all over the mountain in the background. We have this waterfall here. First of all, I will edit this for a post on Instagram. So I will crop it to 4x5, which is the recommended for Instagram if you're using photos. Then I want to create kind of a dramatic and atmospheric look for the edit. So we want it to be a bit more blue, a bit more moody, a bit more dark in my opinion. So the first thing we're gonna do is go down to the toning feature here. We're just gonna turn that saturation up here and now you can see it's getting red. So we're gonna turn it over to a more blue then we go into the glow feature here. We're just gonna turn it up a bit to add some more things up here and add some more light to make it kind of stand out a bit more. And we do want to make it a bit cooler. So now we go into the color harmony here and we're gonna turn up the color contrast a bit so there's a bit more contrast overall, but also contrast with the colors. Then we're just gonna play around with all the dials here. And as I told you, I do want like the the town and the, the city here to be a bit warmer and then we also want the rest to be a bit cooler so I really like how this looks here then we go down to the shadows uh, again we're gonna turn it over to the cyan instead of the red to make sure that the shadows here are getting a bit more blue we don't want to overcompensate it but we do want uh, some blue there maybe turn up the yellow a bit here and that's good for the color harmony. Then overall now, we can also do this in the beginning, but I chose to do it now. We go into the develop tab, pressing auto adjust, just to make sure that everything with the contrast and exposure and highlights is good. We do want the highlights a bit up in my opinion, and then the shadows, we're gonna turn them a bit up as well. So we have the details here. The contrast, the smart contrast, we're gonna turn that. We're actually just gonna keep it at zero. And then when we go into the colors here, I do want to desaturate it because I feel like it's very saturated now. And the vibrance we're gonna turn a bit up, not that much. I like that. So I think the colors for this edit now is pretty good. The vignette is very important in my opinion. We're obviously gonna turn it down here, play around with the sides a bit, just to have some focus in the middle of the photo here. Then I also really like to add the film grain, just a tiny bit here to emphasize and make it a bit more raw. And then we have some really nice AI tools in Lumina Neo that I really like for it is like this, and that's the atmosphere here. You can see when I turn this up, it's gonna add a, very, a lot of fog into the image. We don't want that much, we just want to emphasize the fog up here a bit. And we can always play around with the depth here. One of my favorite things is to play around with masking because you can really emphasize the parts of the photo you want to be in focus and you can darken some of the, the parts of the photo you don't want to be in focus. So we go into the develop tab here and then we go into masking and then I'm just gonna create a linear gradient here. So we make the, the masking, we go into adjustments and then we turn that down. We're gonna keep the same mask here and then we're gonna make another mask down here, darken that a bit as well. You can see the difference now. One thing I do want to do is to go into the color space here and then we're gonna remove some color cast uh, just to make it a bit more dramatic here. I'm gonna show you the before and after on the screen now. I really hope you liked the video and liked the edit that I made on this autumn photo, photo from the Faroe Islands to make it way more moody and atmospheric. Make sure to like the video and comment down below what you think about all the features in Lumina Neo. I will see you very very soon again.